Careful listen about the sets, guys. Careful listen about the sets. I am I'm just explaining it here with the block diagrams. Okay. Now I have two sets. I'm explaining no mathematics. I will tell it as set equals to one, two, three, four. I will tell it as set B is equals to three, four, five, six. I will tell it as set C is equals to uh mm, five six seven eight done and set d is equals to as the two and three so much example is enough for me okay so i have set oh set right okay i should not be list right so i need to put it like this just it just with this i'll mold this I'll mold this, I'll mold this, I'll mold this, I'll mold this. Right? So this is how it is, right? Now come in here, guys. Now do the Venn diagram for the A and B, guys. What will be the Venn diagram for A and B? What will the Venn diagram for the A and B? Uh, three and four is common. I'll write it three and four. And one and two is here. And uh, five and six is here. Right? This is nothing but A, this is nothing but B. Okay, so uh, what is intersecting it? What is intersecting it? Two and three, it is intersecting it. What is different from A? What is A is different from B? One and two is different from B. What is different from B is different from A by five and six. Ah, right? that is what it is. Whether it is disjoint, guys, it is joint actually, right? Both are joined. Okay, because you have a common element. That's the reason it is joint. It's not disjoint. Okay, when I talk about the disjoin, okay, I can tell it as A and B can disjoin, right? For example, A, you have it something like this here. One, two, three, four. And I have it like this. Here also you have it like this. Five, six, seven, eight. I have A here, I have C here. Do you have a common element here? No. And this is called as disjoin. There is no join between both the, both the things. Got it? Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it all? Okay, now I'll come to here. I'll come to here. This is all. If I tell union, if I tell union, it means everything should come. One, two, three, four, five, six. Everything will come into the cup. Okay, three, four, three, four will not repeat it. Why? Because duplicate element will not support in the set. Right? Duplicate element will not support in the set. Now, if I tell that, like I will, I will, I will compare with A and B. Right? In A and B, you draw the Venn diagram for A and B, guys. So in A, you have it one and two. Okay, one and two, two won't be there right two won't be there why two won't be there in here two won't be there why two won't be there because two and three are common here it is one and four right one and four it will be there and here two and three is common palm d ke pas two and three tha aur kuch nahi hai this one difference mein aur kuch nahi hai a b right now a becomes a super set sub super set because a knows everything whatever the b knows a knows it and the d becomes subset okay i'll give you a superset and subset i'll give you a brief example for it okay for example you people know you people know java you people know java you people know py py you people know c you people know c plus plus but i only know c and python okay i only know what c and python now tell me guys who is super who is super you people are super right i become what sub i become sub here if i know one other language which you don't know right which you don't know for example like this okay i'll i'll tell us like this now i'll i know only unix i know unix right i know unix now at the time what happens now no one is super no one is no one is a subset why because i know something which you don't know that means to become a super set it should be like empty itself to become a subset there should be what empty itself here it should be something in common here there should be something in common Okay, even in the empty set, empty set will become what subset of everyone. No knowledge at all. No knowledge at all, right? So what happens now? This becomes subset of this one also. It will become subset of this one also. For both things, it will become subset. Got this picture clear? Got this picture clear? So you got to know what is the difference. The difference is here is like this is what the difference is. This area is called as difference, right? Here, this is the difference. This is the difference, right? Union. Union means what? All the things. Here, here, 
here okay difference plus uh, intersection intersection means what in between whatever the terms are coming this is called as intersection right now is disjoint is disjoint means what this is what the is disjoint whether it is whether it is differentiated or not this is not disjoint this is what is disjoint this is joint actually okay now coming to here is superset whether it is superset yes in this condition it is superset in this condition it is superset in this condition it is superset why a and d is a dot d is superset yes a is superset okay subset who is subset here d is a subset right that is what it is that is what you need to know about it set we were discussing about the set as like what guys uh unique element and uh, uh there is no order of insertion or deletion whatever it is now normally it follows the order of insertion in the sorted order but uh, again when it is coming to the minus number it was showing in other other ways that's that's fine no problem and copy again it is a shallow copy and deep copy clear in the sense like set is clearing it pop in the sense where from where it will pop it guys by default it will pop it from the beginning of the set that this is one thing which you need to remember it and we want to discuss about this difference union in intersection is disjoint is superset it's sub is superset and is subset okay let's start it so i'll just tell us like a is equals to i'll just tell it as like uh, set i'll let us one two three four right so one two three four i'll let us b is equals to i'll just tell us like uh, uh, three comma four comma five comma six all right Tell me, guys, if I tell us a dot, I tell us difference, right? Oh, what is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? D i f f e r e n. Right, difference. Yeah, difference of b. I will tell it. Right, a dot a a a dot difference of b. I will tell it. Tell me what will what might be the output, guys? Tell me what might be the output. With respect to A, what is the difference of B? Is that is this a sentence formation I, I did? May I I made it correct? Okay, I'm getting like this. Okay, with respect to B, what is the difference in A? Now you tell me. That is what it is. With respect to B, what is the difference in A? It's nothing but one two. And because A is coming with respect to with respect to B, what is the difference in A? right with respect to b with respect to b what is the difference of a now i'll tell it with respect to a okay i'll just tell us like difference d i f f e r e n c e right difference a right at this time it is nothing but what five and six got to know the what is difference so we'll get a different element so leaving the common element out you will get the difference element With respect to A, you are getting it here. With respect to A, you are getting it here. With respect to B, you are getting it here. What is difference? When you compare with B, when you're comparing with B, A with B, what is the difference in A? You are comparing with A, B with A. What is the difference in B? Right, that is what it is. The next method is, the next method is, uh, I'll be telling as like union, I will tell it, right? So I'll tell it as like A dot uh, union of B, I'll tell it, right? A dot union of B, I'll tell it. What I'll get it, guys? So everything I'll get it one, two, three, four, five, six. All the all the contents I'll get it. Right? One, two, three, four, and five, six. I'll get it everything. Right? And again, uh, you are done with the difference. You're done with the uh, union. And now this one is like intersection. A dot I'll just say that intersection, right? Intersection of B L Dalet. Right? A dot intersection of B L Dalet, right? So when I tell you this one, so what I'll get it, what is the common between both the things, right? What is the common between the both the things? We got the difference, we got the common, and we got the everything, right? So those three methods are very important. These methods will be very important according to the tables, guys. When you do the pandas, right, uh, you deal with the tables, right? So these questions are like, the set theory will be very much important when you deal with the tables uh maybe like majority in the data science right? this will play a major role you have one table you have one table you need to take what is the difference between these two tables so you take the intersection as so difference you got it unions you got it and uh, okay so what is this unions why this unions i wanted it okay so i want to know from day one to now okay how many of them have attended it right total strength of the class how many of them have attended it? how many of them have participated in it? 
So at the time, I'll go for the union. What was the traffic flow? What's the unique identity you have it? All right? Maybe like you will log in now. Again, you will log in again. You will log. There will be duplicate elements. By that time, what I'll do it, I'll combine with all the unions, with all the things, all the days, one day, two day, three, third day, four day, five day. I'll combine everything and I'll get the only the unique data I'll get. So this is all the peoples have attended it. Right. So now coming to here, uh, there are two methods. Uh, I guess only two methods. Okay, I want to check it whether it is joint or disjoint, right? So joint or disjoint. So how do I how do I check it up? So I'll just tell us a dot a dot. Uh, I'll just tell us whether it is is disjoint, right? I'll just tell us like uh, is. I'll just tell us this. True or false, guys? So I get what false. Like uh, A and B because it is common. I have it other one, right? So I will take it for other other variable like C is equal to I'll just tell us 8 and 9 8 comma 9 I will tell it or it's whatever it is 89 whatever it is, right? So I'll enter this so I'll just tell us a dot I'll just tell us is uh, this or uh, this J Y and T join, right? So I'll let us like B Not B. I'll let us see so it is nothing but what true. Yeah, it is not joined it together. Okay now let us subset Right? Can A and C can be subset, guys? Can A and C can be subset? I'll just tell as A is A dot. I'll just tell us like uh, a subset, subset of B, of C. No, it cannot be right. A cannot be subset. E subset. Sorry, E subset. Okay, so I'll come here. I'll come here. I'll just add E subset. So it is giving true or false, right? So I'll just let C subset. So it is nothing but what false, right? So now which are the two methods are remaining? Yes, so the two methods are remaining. So I'm done with difference, I'm done with union, I'm done with intersection. I'm done with is disjoint. These are all two methods which are remaining it. So what is this is subs is, is superset and subset? Look on here. So I'll take create a, a create a, create a equals so I'll just as like uh, I'll let us like Java, I'll let us like uh, PY, all right? I'll just as like uh, C. And I'll just sell as like C plus plus, right? C plus plus. So I'll open this and I'll close this, and I'll do it B B equals. So I'll just sell as like like this. Okay, so I'll just sell as like what? Uh, Java and PY. I will tell it. Java and PY. I will tell it. Right? Java and PY. I will tell it. Now tell me which is subset and which is superset. Do you have subset and superset over here now? Yes. Which is the superset? This one knows everything. Whatever the whatever he knows, he knows everything, and beyond that, he knows it. And this becomes what B becomes what subset and A becomes what superset, right? So I'll tell us like this: whether A dot A dot is a superset of B, I will tell it, right? Superset of B, yes, it is true, right? I'll just tell us A dot uh, E subset, E subset of B, false, right? I'll just tell us A dot is okay. I'll just tell us like A B dot Once b dot is the a so it is something what true then got it <coughs> got it if b knows one more one more language if it allows b dot i'll just tell us add okay i'll just tell us like uh, unix i'll tell it right unix i'll tell it so if i if i tell it like this okay if i if i add one more language which doesn't know right so it is gone right my jubi jubi bol raha tha ki a uh, e, e bol raha tha na e b is subset karke false ho jayega ye correct right why because b is having something which a doesn't know right so again even empty set empty set for example empty set is equal to d is equal to empty set i'll tell it empty set will be like always a chela right so i'll just tell us like this super set of d i'll tell it yes true right so same thing i'll tell it uh, here also i'll tell it here i'll tell it. instead of b i'll let us like d Empty set is also becoming or uh, D dot. Uh, okay. Okay, it is dictionary. Sorry, 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 sorry. It, is, it becomes dictionary, right? Sorry, sorry, guys. Oh, I am. Um, okay. Like this. It is nothing but what? True. Is a subset? Yes, it is a subset because it doesn't know anything. So in that case, it is. What if the both are equal, guys? What if the both are equal? For example, A equals to I have uh, 
10 comma 20 even in b also i have a 10 comma 20 right what, what is actually guys 10 comma 20 i have it right tell me guys a is a subset of superset of b yes true right a is a super right i'll just say like sub 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 right yes true right when it is equal both are equal e super super set a is consistent a is consistent a is super a is super a but it's not just like combined study karte hai aap right you will do the combined study right same thing it happens that's the same level <clears throat> the both are same level then both are like super set and subset to each other <clears throat> 